Welcome to Safari Science. My name is Reptile Rob, and learning's fun. So let's learn about box turtles. Hi, Reptile Rob here, and I've got my friend Lightning, the ornate box turtle. Hi, Lightning. How's it going? Doing pretty good? Yeah. So why is a box turtle called a box turtle? They obviously do not do boxing matches and they do not eat boxes, but they do something that you can do with a box. You can open a box and close a box. Now turtles and tortoises cannot come out of their shells. Franklin can, but then again, he's a cartoon. The shell on a turtle or tortoise is like their skin. It's hard protective skin. It keeps them safe from danger and they do not come out of it. But a box turtle can do something really cool with their shell that other turtles and tortoises cannot do. And let's take a look at his plastron. The plastron is what you call the belly of the shell and it's right here, it's the undershell. Now his plastron, right over here, it has a hinge which allows it to move. So when something tries to scare or eat a turtle or tortoise, they hide in their shell and usually they have to use their arms to protect themselves. But a box turtle, because it has a hinge on his shell, can actually close his shell up. Now Lightning's not afraid of me, so he's not gonna hide in his shell and close it up, but I can show you how it wiggles a bit. So I'm gonna show you the hinge, and I'm gonna push gently right over here, and see how the shell's moving up and down, up and down, up and down, up and down, up and down. See? <laughs> and he can feel me petting him on the back, so it's like, what's going on? So their shell can actually close. So when they hide in their shell, they close it up and they're sealed away and safe as can be. All right, you guys, I'm Reptile Rob and that's Lightning and we'll see you next time. Thanks for tuning in. Bye-bye.